thanks for driving me to the library for story time, Brian. Today we're reading The Very Hungry Caterpillar versus The Human Centipede. I heard it's like Alien versus Predator with a little bit more butt eating. I'm just saying, we should go to the library at Quahog University and take your education to a higher level. I guess I can try it. I mean, I do want to get ahead. I don't want to end up like Meg doing sad one-woman shows. I love trash! Whose fault is this? You're wearing a garbage bag as a cape. Who do you think? Him? Shh, she's crushing it! Oh, yeah. That's good library. Oh, you didn't come here for me. You came to be a creep. Whatever, you go do your thing. I'm gonna go watch that young hotshot attorney over there who's clearly in the middle of a movie montage. Oh, he found it! He's gonna win the case! Oh, no, it was a 70s movie. So, who are you reading? George Eliot. Ah, Georgie. I'm a big fan. I think he, uh... She. She said it best when she said, Bantam Press, 1851. What's going on over there? Looks like a student rally. They probably forgot to study for an exam, so they organized a protest. In the 90s, you just pull a fire alarm. Now you hold a protest. Yeah. Hey, what's going on? Someone wrote weird on the transgender bathroom and the school president didn't overreact, so we want him fired. Because a professor told his class to have a nice day, which is microaggression, because in our systemic rape culture, no day is a nice day. So we want him fired, too. I guess I could fire up my account again. All right, open app. Got a bunch of those, no biggie. Type in tweet. See? Up, oh, you're gone. And the crowd is gone. And the animators are gone. Hey, Stewie, what do you think about this tweet? Oh, don't be that guy. Kelly Ripa no-shows at work. Who does she think she is? A Republican senator? <laughs> Unless you're an athlete or a celebrity, no one cares. A lot of people like my stuff. Oh, yeah? Someone needs to tell Donald Trump it's not fashionable to wear orange on your face after Labor Day. And what can I get for you, sir? I'll have the shepherd's pie. I'm sorry, but that's not on the menu. Well, do you have potatoes? Yes. Butter? Yes. Chicken broth? Yes. Corn? Yes. Peas? Yes. Lightsaber? Remember when we did Star Wars? I better get a tweet out before I go dark for a few hours. About to see the new Kevin Hart movie. Just kidding. I'm white and went to college. Hashtag Baywatch movie. Wow, haven't seen that much camel toe since the Arab Spring. Hashtag thinking in tweets. Uh-oh. Wow, you are blowing up! Blowing up bad. <laughs> oh, look at that. Huffington Post just picked it up. This is getting out of control. We can't leave the house without getting harassed. Yeah, yesterday I went outside to try to get the mail, and I had a seizure. You have to apologize. Go outside, do it now. Tell them that it was a mistake and how sorry you are, and maybe they'll get off our backs. Maybe you're right. I gotta face them and hope they'll forgive me. I wanna read a few words. Boo, liar, boo, Brian Griffin, boo. Anyway, I, I boo. wanna... Boo, apologize somewhere else, boo, boo. Gentlemen and ladies... Who says the man? Okay, sorry, I, I, um... Humans in the audience. I identify as a basketball. Humans and basketballs. I'm a parrot who mimics words but doesn't comprehend them. All right, all right, uh, just, just calm down, okay? Now you're tone policing us. That makes me uncomfortable. Anything that makes me uncomfortable in 2017 should be illegal. You know what? <laughs> well, I assure you, there are. And just for the record, I love black people. I watch tons of black porn. So what do you all want from me? Huh? Do you want to ruin my life? Then congratulations, you did it. Leave me alone! I'm the self-righteous liberal douchebag, not you! I've kissed a transsexual before! How many of you can say that? Where's my medal? I am so far left, I'm spinning in circles! Well, we started the dialogue. You screamed black porn at the top of your lungs in front of women and children. Thank God you have my back. We think you should move out. What? Oh! Brian, listen, we love you, but they're throwing things at our house. Does this slow pan across our disapproving faces answer your question? I saw Baywatch. That thing was frickin' rad. Yeah, I messed up, but what about all the stupid things Peter's done? He's never been kicked out in his life. My life is not the issue here. 
Peter, calm down. Did you eat breakfast this morning? I had a banana and a coffee. I guess this is goodbye. Ryan, wait! This collar is ours. It has our address on it. Peace, dude. All right, radio, time for you to tell me what this all means. I got a pocket full of quarters and I'm headed to the arcade. Pac-Man fever! Pac-Man fever! Driving me crazy! Driving me crazy! Here, apartment 23. Oh, okay. I just have one rule here. No kissing the mailman. I don't think that's going to be a problem. You haven't seen him, so don't say that yet. Mail's here. Sir, do you mind if I go ahead of you? Uh, yes, I do mind. Six dollars. Hey, did you knock over a few bottles in aisle seven? Uh, yeah. <sighs> okay. Yeah, now I'm gonna tell you where it is. I knew you knew where it was, you liar! Tell me where it is! No, find it yourself. Oh, okay, fine. Boom. Damn it. Previously on Family Guy, certain of his own wit and intellect, Brian opened up a Twitter account, suddenly made Brian a pariah to all of Quahog, forcing the family to make the difficult choice of sending him to a crappy apartment. Good luck, everyone. I'll miss you. Oh, something's coming. I said you're a week late on your rent. Well, I can get you the money. Hang, hang on, let me just make a call. I told you we should have rehearsed this. Lois, can we do it over? No, that's eight times. Just leave a message. I'm sorry. 10 o'clock, you're probably on the couch watching Pawn Stars. So, uh, pick up. Pick up. Uh, da, 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 da. Well, again, it's Brian. Um, guys, really, really, call me back. It's Brian. Bye. Well, you gotta do something, Brian. You're a week behind. Okay, okay, look, I'll get a job, okay? There's gotta be something I can do. It's not like I'm Ringo. Hey, before you tell us, I'm gonna go and smoke a thousand cigarettes. And I'm gonna move to New York City and walk in and out of my building. Welcome aboard, Brian. This is your co-worker, Martha. Pleased to meet you, Brian. Pleasure's all mine. So watch out, or you might end up in one of my scripts. Martha, gorgeous, headstrong, legs as long as spaghetti noodles, enters. Hey, I'm a pathetic dog whose family kicked him out and I want to kill myself. Stewie? Hey, Brian, how's the new job going? What are you doing here? I'm always here. Suicide is not a nine to five problem. Yeah, so I was thinking maybe we could Netflix and grill. Well, nothing says I can't date her up here. Let's see what kind of Facebook account we got for this, Martha. Yep, private account. I can work with this. You know, this is exactly what Dr. Fishbein was talking about. I never go for it. You know what, Brian? I will. <gasps> oh, my God! <gasps> Gross! You scumbag! Dr. Ah, uh, Martha. It's gonna work out. Tried everything, Lou. I told her I was sorry. I even sent flowers. Do what I do when people don't pay their rent. Plant drugs and call the cops. I don't know. I may be broke, but that seems like a crappy thing to do to somebody. Well, then you're evicted. My trunk is full of coke. Brian Griffin, your life's about to change. You were complimenting me. Um, what? Tell him you have no idea how your hair strands got in that baggy. Hello, officer! Is this your desk, ma'am? Yeah, why, officer? Found it. You're gonna have to come with us. And Jeff, you might want to call your sponsor. You did this, didn't you? I knew you were a little twerp as soon as I met you. Oh, 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 my leg is broken! Only thing I can possibly do is lick it repeatedly. 
If my life were better here, would I stop searching for it up there?